people, 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 people. Que pasa, suck, pasé, what they do. Welcome to Crime Time News, where the difference is in the meds. Now, the other day, I got a video. In this video, there was an individual. It is said that this individual is Mr. Dodos, C-O-K-E, infamous gangster from Jamaica, extradited to America. I heard that he got some whole heap of time, quarter time of the NBA, 25 or so. However, people, at least one thing we can say about this man, he is holding it down like a G. Not to glorify any sorts of gangsterism. However, unlike some people, we don't hear no sorts of talking upon him name. So I am going to show you a video in which he took off his cell in a penal institution. I am assuming that he's in one of those penitentiary based on the fact that he was locked up, he was convicted of a gangster. However, people, may not know which level he is at. However, he is showing the lifestyle of a gangster, the prison edition. But people, here's the thing. He is playing Sizzler's song. Solid like a rock. They just can't hold me now. However, as it pertains to YouTube, you know that whenever there is any sorts of music in the background, you cannot really play it or else your video is not going to be monetized. And you know that I am not one of those beggy beggy channels. You know who they are. So therefore, I am going to let it play and I am going to tell you exactly what he is saying. Take a listen, take a look, and then I'll give my peace. So people, your sister, him kind of get older. Him a put on a little weight, and he is pointing out, listen, this is the person, you know, the face. Him a looking at the camera, and he is saying what he is saying. So people, take a listen, take a look at the beautiful bean footage. He is going to show you the galaxy in the ceiling. Him say when him lay down and look on him roof, he might look upon the galaxy. So therefore, him now penetrate no source of negativity. He is showing you his flat screen, 19 inch, where he sees, you see, some sort of shark. He might show you the rest of the room, the fan. He might show you him system, him boombox, him stereo. People, I don't tell a lie, the man keep him place neat. However, in those penal institutions in America, I saw the place of need or else you probably get some sorts of ticket. Take a listen, take a look at the wall. You see my show you him CD collection in a him whatnot, in a him whatever you call it. People, this man is living better life than most persons upon the street because when you go to some people's yard, it don't look nothing neat like this. He might show you him lotion and obviously him now a woman. So therefore that lotion might come in handy. People, that was a joke. He might show you him commissary. Now people, what commissary is, it is like you and I going to the grocery store as a free man. People, your sister, the man, not really lack for anything. He does not have any sorts of need. After all, they claim that he smuggled X amount of cocoa. So therefore, he is investing that cocoa money. He must show you in beans. He must show you in mackerel. He must show you in snacks. People, the man I live life. He is living life better than most persons. Are not most people. Because the truth and the fact is that if you are not free, that is life by itself taken away. He must show him all sorts of cosmetic, whatever he uses. People, the man is living life. Point blank and period. So people, he continues to give you some sorts of tour of his place. We see him keeping place neat and like me say, them place that can boogie yaga adjust to the system sets. He is also going to show you his dinner. Now people, the man have him rice and peas, look like him have brown stew chicken. Him cover it up because on a too greedy, him no want a body for pies named food. So people like me say, he might show the Bob Marley picture them upon the wall. He might show the duck. He might show this is what the duck gets. F-U-C-K. When you come to prison. However, people, like me say, 
he should be lucky that he was not incarcerated, convicted in a Jamaica because them a prisoner, they don't look nothing like that. However, more than likely, if he was incarcerated in a Jamaica, he would be out. So people, take a look at the loaded board, take a look at the chair, take a look at the bed, neatly spread, take a look at his paperwork, I guess his indictment people, I don't really know. Take a look at the carpet, he is showing everything and he is dancing, he is bouncing. However, people, in reality, the facts are these. If you've lost freedom, whatever amount of money that you get, it cannot replace, it cannot replicate anybody's thoughts of freedom. At the end of the day, your situation is your situation. You have a couple of choices. You can make the best of a bad situation or you can J-U-M-P. I recommend that you take the first. So therefore, he is saying, listen, this is a lifestyle of your G. This is a lifestyle of Dodos, C-O-K-E. This is part one. Look forward to part two. Coming soon at a theater. OC, social media site. Next to you, point blank and period. Now the next thing that is popping in the news, it is called Turn your yard as much as you can whenever possible. However, people, it seems as if persons cannot follow this very simple rule and they end up learning the very hard way. I am speaking about an incident that occurred in a place called Norwood, Norwood, St. James, Montego Bay, Wednesday night at about 8 something pm. Based on the information, it is said that persons were at a shop, they were playing dominoes, S H O O T I N G, the breeze. When two armed men roll up, blaze up some corn. After the SMOKE cleared, at least six persons were hit. Four persons are in very serious condition right now at the hospital. However, two of those persons that did not make it, I am speaking about 31 year old Delano Christie. He is said to be the shopkeeper at that shop in which the people em blaze up. The next person that was very unfortunate, Jordan Brown, unemployed. Now people, when you hear the name or hear unemployed, that is the title that is always given to persons that are sometimes associated with all sorts of criminal activity. However, not in all cases. So therefore, one man, hard-working man, the next man, 26-year-old Jardian Brown, no sorts of employment. And people like them say, the devil always finds work for idle. Now we know that places like Norwood, St. James, Montego Bay is plagued with all sorts of gang activity, all sorts of violence. It always remained dormant for a day or two, maybe a week, maybe a month. However, something always flares up because of so many gangs in the era, so many idle minds, so many evilest people. So people, once them hear any sorts of entertainment, any sorts of music, especially chopper music, you know that it is as if it flares them up. It is as if they are under some sorts of spell to go out and S-H-O-O-T innocent people. Now people like me say, six people. Out of those people that I am mostly concerned about, it is also said that a nine-year-old is also in a place of recovery. Nine months, sorry. Not nine-year-old, not that it is much better. However, when you talk about nine months versus nine years, what type of pain? This little you just banned the other day less than a year ago and he has to go through people maybe this is a sign of things to come hopefully he can get out the family can somehow get him out of volatile communities like this because this is a very bad start this little youth is going to be emotionally traumatized for the rest of his young life point blank and period so people hopefully the poor poor do their job and based on information that i am getting the elders, they are tight-lipped. Nobody is saying anything 
other than it has to do with the young youth them the vipers out there now people the thing is that now with st james is a place that has been going on bad for a couple of decades however it seems as if until it reaches these persons doorstep or them yard them not gonna say nothing none at all they are going to remain mum nobody not talk so pretty much see i'm blind ear and deaf point blank and period so anyways people thanks once again for checking out my video if you appreciate videos straight to the point no sorts of beating around the bush show your appreciation by liking commenting sharing and subscribing to my channel that is how YouTube promotes videos like these to like-minded, sensible persons like yourself. And last but not least, word to the wise. Whenever you are rising in life, there's always going to be a set of vipers. They see your potential. They see that your ceiling is in the stratosphere. However, when they look at themselves, they realize that because of their insecurity and mostly because of their hate, their ceiling is in the cellar, in the abyss of hell. So therefore, for them to feel as if they are up, they are going to do everything within their means to bring you down, point blank and period.